is your boy Will back with another video today hope you guys are doing good and into this video I will be talking about GameStop stop corporation trigger symbol GME stop okay so I'll be giving you guys some genes a GME stock analyst some key levels you want to be looking out for on Tuesday okay because the market is closed on Monday for Memorial Day so these levels will be for Tuesday and I'll be giving you guys let's see one key support level yeah that, that almost hit today actually so I'll give you guys one key support level and the level that I'm looking to buy as well okay and there's also a resistance level above price too so I'll give you all three of those levels and let's get into the video so make sure you guys smash the like button let's get this video over 30 likes I really appreciate it subscribe and turn your post notifications so you don't miss any updates you can hit that little button down there and subscribe now our options uh, option signals are live now so you can get that on the website link which is the first link down below you can start um, getting that for options signals for buy and sell alerts okay now for GME first I would give you the resistance level above price so let me which is over, let me see it is at I'm around it because it's about 50 cents off so I'm gonna say 278 let me go to the hourly okay so 278 give or take around 50 cents is around the resistance level let me type it 278 make that red so this is the resistance level that I see right now as you can tell the high came to about around 268 so about ten dollars off from that high and then it starts selling down like I told you guys if you want to see that consistent run up you need that pullback and we're finally getting that pullback but this is the first resistance level that I see around 278 give or take 50 cents okay then for the support level let's zoom in and again these levels are for Tuesday the first support level I see is 217 217 is a support level I'll type it in 217 we'll leave that blue for support this is where I think we will see some trading sideways so like say once the stock come here it might trade sideways around this area okay for a support now the level that I will actually be looking to buy shares at since we are finally getting that down move is around to 213 213 and lower okay so this is where I'll be looking to get shares at for Tuesday okay around 213 and lower okay so your resistance level was at 278 support level is at 217 and my buying level I wanted to go 213 or lower and then I'll start buying shares as it drops down here to see price go over that uh, 278 mark and also to around 300 okay so from the entry to that exit that would be about let's go back to the hourly again you do want to wait for a confirmation around this level around that buying area to see if we see some buying pressure there okay because that will confirm so it'll be about a 30 percent gain which will be good so I'll probably take some shares out right here around 60 to 70 percent and then I'll hold the rest to continue going higher okay I'll just wait to see I'll just watch to see how far it can go but I will be looking to buy around 213 and lower support around that 217 and then resistance at 278 all three levels that I'm looking at right now and really the only three levels I'm looking at okay so I hope you guys like the video uh, tomorrow I'll be posting a video on AMC so make sure you check that out tomorrow and again don't forget the buy and sell options a lot is live on the website so you can get that first link in the description you can also get uh, two free stocks of Webull. Get your Webull account down below as well because we will be going back on the competition. Okay. So, hope you guys like the video. Always remember, not just recommendation to buy or sell anything, just for educational purposes only. So, do not trade anything you see or hear this video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.